Hello, good evening, and welcome you to today's lesson. Today we are going to take a look at reflection of light. So basically, when you say reflection of light, reflection of light, it is the bouncing back of light into the same medium when it strikes a smooth surface. So when you reflect a light or you incident a light on a smooth surface and you see the direction of the light coming back into the same medium, that is the condition, the same medium when we say reflection has occurred. So basically we have two laws of reflection. So this is the first law of reflection. It says that the incident view, the reflected view, and the normal at the point of incident all lie in the same plane. So now let's go to the board and represent this diagrammatically. Okay, from the first law, he said that the incident ray, the reflected ray, and the normal at the point of incident all lie in the same plane. So this is a mirror. This is a mirror. So this is one plane, this is another plane. So we say that the incident ray. So this is the incident ray. So this is the normal. The normal is a line from perpendicular to the reflecting surface. So at the point of incident, this is the point of incident. So we are saying that the incident ray, the reflected ray, at the point of incident, all lie in the same plane. So this is one plane. This is one plane. So both the incident, the reflected, the normal, they all lie in the same plane. So the second law of reflection also states that the angle of incident is equal to the angle of reflection. So let's go to the diagram and indicate the angles. So, say the angle of incidence is the angle of incidence. Say so it, it is equal to the angle of reflection. So, the angle of incidence, let's, let's replace that with R. And the angle of reflection, small r. So, if this angle is 55 degrees, then it means that. The angle of reflection with the small r is also 55 degrees. But the angle of the straight line add up to 180. So when we add the 55 plus 55, we will get 110. So basically we are left with 70 degrees. So it means that these two angles here, they will share the 70 degrees. So from here, so this place is 70 degrees. So this angle is also 35 degrees. And this one also 35 degrees. So basically the two laws, this is how you can represent the laws diagrammatically. So thank you for watching Nanny TV. Please subscribe, like, follow, and share. Thank you.